Hi Geeks, welcome to the 10 forumscom In this video, we will relocate the users folder to another drive when installing Windows, saving storage space on system drive C. All future user profile folders will then be automatically created on the new location instead of C users. To start, install Windows normally. When asked for the product key, select I don't have a product key and install Windows without it. When installation finally arrives to settings dialog, press Ctrl Shift F3 to reboot to audit mode. The audit mode is a special customization mode of Windows. The system will now sign you in using the built-in administrator account. Right-click the Start button, select Run, type iExplore.exe and click OK to open Internet Explorer. Open the tutorial link in video description. You will find the code needed for the answer file under method 1 step 2 in the tutorial. Copy the code and paste it to a new text file in Notepad. Change lines 4, 6 and 10 as told in the tutorial. In this example, I have to change the processor architecture to x86 because I'm installing a 32-bit Windows, the new location for the users folder to be on drive E, and finally the location of the install media I'm using, the install.wim file to be D sources folder. Save the file, name it as you wish with extension .xml. I will name it now relocate.xml. Select file type as all files, click save.
the answer file is ready. Processor architecture correctly set. The new location for users folder correctly set and the location for the install.vim file correctly set. Right-click the Start button, select Command Prompt Administrator. Use the CD command to jump to SysPrep folder. Enter the SysPrep command, see the tutorial for detailed instructions. SysPrep will now prepare the move of the users folder and restart the computer. Finalize the Windows installation normally. As you can see, the drive C has no users folder anymore. The users folder has been completely moved to another drive. All user accounts and profile folders in the future will be created in this new location. When installing Windows using an MS account, the system gives the user profile a five-letter abbreviation. I will now show how to avoid that and get the profile named as you wish. First, when creating the initial user account, create a local account instead of an MS account. Use the name you want to, it will be used for your user profile. In this example, I named the local account as 10 forums. The user profile folder is now named as I wanted. I can now switch my local account to a Microsoft account and the profile folder and its name will remain the same, the one I wanted to use.
That's it. Your users folder has been completely relocated to another drive, saving the storage space on the system drive. More Windows 10 news, tips, videos and tutorials at the10forums.com.